What's up, y'all? GQ here again. Um, I have a special video for you guys today. Not just any video, but a review video. My very first review video, and I'm super, super excited to bring it to you guys. I actually went out and bought some boots. Yes, some boots. Not just any boots, but some Harley Davidson heated boots. I ride pretty much throughout the year, and in the winter months, it can get pretty cold. My feet get pretty cold. And I stumbled upon these boots, and I said, hey, let me pick them up. Uh, hopefully, they'll keep my feet a little warm or very warm um, while I'm riding. So I'll give you guys my personal thoughts and opinions, as well as some of the features of the boot on the channel. Stay tuned. The first thing that I noticed about them that they look pretty, pretty good to me. Um, they're well crafted. Uh, they're very stylish, gives off a very military type look to it. Um, one of the things that I didn't really like, I don't, I don't care for the the, uh, the little wrap around parts when you're stringing up the boots. I don't like that. Uh, another thing that it has is that they're waterproof. So the way they're constructed, um, they have little areas for water to kind of just roll off the boot instead of your boot actually getting wet. Um, it gives very, very, very good ankle support up in this area. So your um, upper ankle is very, very uh, secure. And it's sturdy. It, this is, I mean, it's a very, very rough and rugged boot. How do the boots work? So if I turn them around to you guys, there is a Velcro tab that opens up and then it has a pigtail on each side. It comes with a dual male charger and you just plug it in. One side. Once you plug them in, you see that the boots start blinking. When the boots are done charging, it takes approximately four to six hours to charge from my opinion, from me just you know playing around with the boots and putting them on the charger. Uh, and once it's done charging, the HD logo will be a solid red. Um, once it's done, you're supposed to keep it on according to the, uh, the manual. Just keep them charged up uh, so they can work at optimal conditions and things like that but once they're done charging how you operate them is you press the HD symbol on the back for three seconds and then it lights up so this is supposed to be the hottest setting which is red obviously and it's supposed to go up to like 140 degrees or something like that internally in my opinion it does not do that uh the second one it press and hold it's a yellowish color and then the third obviously is green in each setting it's a lower heat setting what i've noticed turn this one on, is that they don't really get hot in my opinion now some people may have very sensitive feet but in my opinion they do not get hot at all even on the hottest setting um, my feet may get a little warm a little warm but they don't get hot and that's what i was looking for heat when i say heated boots i'm looking for hot and it's more warm but for the price of a hundred bucks that i found at uh Harley Davidson of Jackson, Mississippi. It's not bad. It's not bad. Will I recommend them? No. It's a no for me. I can't recommend them for the heated aspect for them. Now, as far as just wearing them, uh, they're pretty comfortable. They give great ankle support. They look really good to me. It's a nice military style boot. 
but the heating portion, I'm gonna have to say no. A lot of people are looking for these boots because of the heated aspect of it. So I cannot, with a good conscience, recommend the boot to my fellow riders. I will recommend the hot wired insoles, the heated insoles, and I'll do another video on that at another time. Drop a comment below with your thoughts. If you have these boots, let me know your thoughts on it. If they get hot to you, um, I love to engage with you guys. And as always, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Everything helps me as a small YouTuber, and I would really, really appreciate, appreciate it. Um, so thank you guys for tuning in. And be yourself, be you, be cool. Peace out.